Thank you and welcome to the show this morning. The topic this morning is college admissions and support, and we're fortunate to have with us this morning to talk about college admissions and support, Dr. John Cade. Dr. Cade is the Dean of Admissions at Tennessee State University, and of course with Dr. John Cade is Mr. Lois Lewis. Uh, Ms. Lewis, Ms. Lewis is the director for the Tennessee State University Foundation. And of course, let me welcome both you, Dr. Cade and Ms. Lewis, to uh, the show this morning. Mm -hmm. And to talk about what we consider to be a very, very important uh, topics, and that is uh, college admissions and uh, support. Uh, and before we get into that, Ms. Lewis, let's have you and uh, Dr. Cade to give us some information about, uh, starting with you, Dr. Cade, to give us some information about your background and your education and some of the things that eventually led you to the deanship of the admissions and recruitment area at Tennessee State University. Of course, uh, Ms. Lewis will give us the same information about her directorship of the Tennessee State University Foundation. Let's start with you, uh, Dr. Uh, first of all, thank you, Dr. Haney, for have asking me to uh, come. Uh, my education and work experience span, span some 25 or more years. Uh, having completed uh, several degrees, uh, two master degrees and currently the doctorate degree. Um, I have worked in several universities throughout the country uh, as administrator and faculty uh, person. Uh, within the past 10 years, I worked as uh, a registrar at one university and currently I'm at uh, Tennessee State University, as you have mentioned, as the Dean of Admissions and Records. Uh, during the uh, time that I have uh, worked at these various schools, I made it a point, a major objective, to uh, further my educational background by taking advantage of the opportunities afforded employees of higher education uh, at all universities of which I've worked. Uh, have received degrees. Uh, my first master's degree was received from South Carolina State College mm -hmm. in Orangeburg. My second was received from Bowie State University in Maryland. Mm -hmm. And within the period of time that I've been here mm -hmm. at uh, Tennessee State University, I have received the Doctorate of uh, Administration and Supervision at Tennessee State mm -hmm. University. Mm -hmm. Now, my place of employment and our model. Very good. <laughs> and, and of course, and, and I think that, that that's a very, very encouraging thing to say uh, because I think, Ms. Lewis, what we've talked about to many people about uh, many opportunities that are available and, and how people can take advantage of that. Uh, uh, Ms. Uh, Lewis, uh, as the director of the Tennessee State University Foundation, let's talk about your background and then we'll talk about the uh, Tennessee State University Foundation. I am a graduate, uh, an undergraduate of Tennessee State University. Uh, I completed my master's degree at Tennessee State. Uh, my background, um, really actually I started out in uh, education. Uh, teaching fifth grade. Um, later decided to go and work as a counselor at Fisk University. Um, got an opportunity to return to Tennessee State University as the Dean of Women. Um, after being there for a while I was actually recruited uh, to go work for Tennessee State Government as the assistant commissioner as the Department of General Services under the administration of Lamar Alexander. Afterwards, um, decided to try out on my own and go out into my own and own my own business. Um, I worked in that area uh, for several years and there was just a burning desire that I had within me that I wanted to go back uh, into higher education because I wanted to make a difference. Um, I wanted to go out and help young, especially uh, black males, mm -hmm. uh, to have a better chance in life because of what I was actually seeing uh, that was happening to uh, our young black men. Mm -hmm. I went back to Tennessee State University as the associate director, uh, uh, associate dean of students mm -hmm. and the director of resident life. But I didn't really feel like I was really making a difference mm -hmm. because the problem that I continued to see in that area was that I saw students uh, always having the need for money. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the 
drawback was that uh, the student was, would come in and say, uh, I have to go back home because mm -hmm. I can't afford it. Mm -hmm. um, I made a, 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 a pledge, basically, if I could ever go out and raise money mm -hmm. Uh, to give, or if I even had it to give, that that's what I really wanted to do. And an opportunity was open for me to go in and to work in the area of development and the TSU Foundation. And that's what I've tried to focus a lot of my 